I'm currently 10,000 feet above sea level. Cool. Welcome to day two of seven of a week in Hawaii. Guys, I just want to talk about a couple of things. I just got out of the shower, so my hair is kind of wet right now. But um, we just scheduled a trip to the top of a, an inactive volcano, so it's not going to erupt. We're going to go to the top, and we're just going to bike down from the top of it. In about an hour, we're about to go to a surf class. And I'm going to be surfing some waves for my second time. Last time I was here, I, I've been here once before. I took the same class. And uh, we're doing it again because it was a lot of fun. So many fish here. You can't see all of them exactly, but there's some bigger ones too. It's just really cool to see these because you never really get this close. Also, the birds that are here, they don't fly away when you get close to them. Instead, they just like casually walk around you like they're people. Okay, guys, so I just got back from the surf lessons about an hour ago, and it was a lot of fun. I am I was not allowed to bring my camera. I didn't. I don't have a GoPro, so if I had a GoPro, I probably could have uh, recorded it, but. I do have some pictures because there's a professional photographer there. It cost like $10 to get the photo, so you may as well. So I'll put those photos on screen now. It's been more of a chill day today. We haven't done much, so uh, this will probably be it for today. And uh, if so, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, I wonder what's behind the store. Wow, another door. Hello guys and welcome to day number three of a week in Hawaii. Yesterday I went surfing and I showed you guys that picture of when I was surfing because we weren't allowed to bring the camera with us and uh, I do have a pretty bad sunburn right now on my face. So just yesterday I was walking around and apparently there's another area that I didn't know about. Oh, yes, I love walking through automatic doors and it's so satisfying. Hey guys, so I finally found it. As you can see, there's a huge pool here that I didn't even know about. And also there's a, another pool down there. They have gazebos where you can just kind of chill out. I think you have to reserve spots for that though. They have a basketball hoop. And I think there's like a water slide. Yeah, there's a blue water slide right over there. So this pool is just huge. They have a rock waterfall right over there. This thing is so much bigger than I thought. I thought it was just that other pool, but I'll probably be hanging out over here a bit more. I also saw a ping pong table in the other direction. So I'll probably be over there occasionally, playing with somebody. I don't know. Somebody was at the ping pong table, so I feel weird recording them. Found a lizard. Dude, if I were like two years longer, I'd probably be chasing this thing right now. Hey, buddy. This guy's like on the surface. They don't swim away when you get close to them. But, uh, you know it'd be cool if I took that sea wag thing? If I put that on my phone and I put this underwater, that'd be so cool. They have like the POV of the fish. Oh, that'd be awesome. Currently in a germ box right now, aka the elevator. The reason I'm up here is to show you guys this view. This is probably the best view I've seen. Like while I'm here, it gets better. I'm just gonna show you guys. There's a wall right here. I'm gonna go step over though. Well, I'm back in the germ box. Okay guys, so it's a lot later that day. It's like 8 p.m. right now, I think. No, it's like 9 p.m. Hawaiian time. But yeah, so it's uh, pretty late. And uh, I'm by the pool right now, and what I'm gonna do is, uh, there's nobody, there's no staff around right now, so I'm gonna go down the slide and I'm gonna show you a bit of clips that I'm gonna take uh, before I go to bed. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Can I just get down here? Oh god, my legs are hurting. Come on. Ah. Also guys, it's important to follow the rules, which includes not climbing on the rocks. So, oh shoot, let me just climb down from here real quick. All right guys, welcome to day four of a week in Hawaii. Guys, I'm having a great day. It's about 10 in the morning right now. And at about 10.30, there's an event that's taking place. This is, this is a huge chair. So there's this event that's taking place. We just feed the koi that are right behind us. So yeah, uh, that's gonna be at 10.30. And about a half hour after that, there's gonna be another event. I'm gonna be snuba diving, and I'm gonna go about like 300 feet. I d I've done this before. Last time I was here, like two years ago. You can hear the fish in about half an hour, but yeah, we're, I'm gonna see if I can take my camera down. And if not, then I can just show you some pictures. Cause I'm sure there's gonna be a photographer there or something. But that's gonna be a lot of fun. So see you guys there. Put like five in your hand. It ate it from my hand. That's so good. 
Okay guys, so we talked to the lady about the snuba diving, and apparently there's just a demo for the pool. So we're doing the, we are doing snorkeling, or we are going underwater, but it's gonna be at the pool, and it's just gonna be like, to teach you what you're supposed to do. I know, I've done this before, but I should probably do it again since it's been a while, so. The real thing is uh, gonna be the day after tomorrow at 8.30 a.m., so I'll see you guys there. I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna record the demo or not, but if not, I'll see you guys later. I'm currently 10,000 feet above sea level. Cool. It's a little hard to see right now, but we're not only above 10,000 feet, we're also above the clouds, and you can see in the distance. I don't know if it's too uh, dark or not, but uh, the sunrise is starting to come up. This is apparently the fifth rarest plant in the planet. Okay guys, so currently we're at a rest stop right now. We're not allowed to bring our cameras with me. I, mean, I can't record uh, while we're biking, but I can show you uh, where we're stopping. And it's just awesome. You can see the waterway in the back, but I'm having fun so far. It's a bit of a slow pace. The bikes are okay. They're not too great. You can't like stop quickly. It's kind of a slower process for the brakes, but other than that, it's been fun. Alright guys, I am back. It's been eight hours now since I've woken up and I've left the timeshare. And right now I'm back at the timeshare. And the ride uh, was a lot of fun. I'm just here showing so The ride was a lot of fun. So the bikes were not very good. I mean, they did not They did have brakes, but you could barely use them. You couldn't even stop completely. You couldn't make like really, really quick stops. It just wasn't possible. You had to kind of slow down over a period of time, like five seconds, which doesn't sound like much, but when you're on the road, it can be pretty painful to wait. But uh, other than that, it was a lot of fun. As for everything else that I have planned to do, um, we're going to the, what is it? We're gonna go snuba diving tomorrow at 8.25 a.m. So that's basically tomorrow morning before they, uh, that's like, yeah, that's like by the time they're feeding the fish, but I just got back. Like I said, it's about 8.20. 8.30, and they're just now about to start feeding the fish breakfast, and people haven't even woken up yet. So just wanted to put that in perspective. I've been awake for eight hours now, so as you can imagine, I'm really tired. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I made the world's <laughs> tiniest pancake. It's about 7 p.m. today, day six of a week in Hawaii. And right now, there is a movie that's taking place in about 15 minutes. We're going to go watch that. It's going to be Sing, and I haven't seen that yet. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.